loves her iPhone vlogs, so I'm starting off with an iPhone vlog. So, just got out of spin, and I took Katie's class. Katie's my home dog because she's the reason why I even go to Cycle Bar. Like, I discovered it, like... January of last year. She's the one that signed me up for my membership. And then when she did, I was terrified to take any of her classes because I thought she was legit crazy in <laughs> the nicest way possible. And then I started taking her classes. I'm like, oh my God, like best workout ever. Literally the best workout ever. She just pushes you to your limits and it's like great. Like I love her with my whole entire heart. However, her classes are either like really late in the afternoon or super early in the morning. And her classes literally are when I never want to get out of bed in the morning and when I take my nap time. <laughs> work so um i have a bad habit of sleeping through hers and actually one of the lead instructors classes which is such a bad habit of mine and they probably think i hate them but i i literally don't it's just i don't want to i don't want to wake up <laughs> i woke up this morning it was a very good class sweat a lot i've been burning a lot of calories recently so that just means i've been pushing myself to my limits which is so wonderful and it's supposed to be cloudy all day today wonderful got my coffee this has been my go-to coffee order it's a grande iced oat milk latte with an extra shot and the vanilla sweet cream cold foam because i like flavor in my coffee and that's why i've been doing the protein coffee however the vanilla sweet cream cold foam is so fucking good it definitely isn't the best however this is giving blue bottle vibes because i only get oat milk at blue bottle i haven't been a blue bottle in a hot second um but it's just so good and it's been my go-to just showered put on eye masks Put my hair in a little claw clip, got dressed. I'll show you all my outfit and I'm going to do an outfits of the week for Lululemon. I have so much to do right now, so I guess I was approved to be a like to know it creator and I literally thought that like I was going crazy because I literally applied like three months ago and um, I emailed them. And I was like, hey, like what the heck? And they were like, um, girl, you've been approved for like the past month. And I was like, oh, wonderful. I was like, holy shit, this is like so convenient. I'm so glad that like I asked like as I did because I have a favorites video going up and like now I can like link all my outfits. So I don't know. I feel like it'll help me like bring up my game being a content creator because like I feel like I just got re-inspired and a video i uploaded a few uploads ago which should be a long time now because i think i'm like six videos ahead right now i was talking about like how discouraged i was and oh my god the amount of comments i got on that video was like so crazy to me and i was like wow there's a lot more people than i thought that like really want to see me grow as well and one of the commenters was like or one of my subscribers said like a lot of it has to do with luck and I'm like you're totally right like literally someone could be busting their booty but the algorithm just isn't in their favor so thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart for even commenting on that video because I was I was in a low 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 place so you guys just really made me feel loved and I couldn't appreciate y'all more honestly and I love y'all so much honestly I really really do so I'm gonna write down everything I need to get done because oh my god do I have so much to get done I want to leave my house by like 10, 10 30 ish because I have a lot of product that I want to give back to Lululemon because if y'all didn't know, we came out with like a new program called um, like new, but I'm going to stop talking now because I really, really need to write this all down. So I'm going to do that. First things first, what I want to do is update the links on my video that's about to go up, um, which is my ultimate favorites, and then I'm going to start editing my video that I filmed yesterday. So we are going to do all that. <laughs> Waffle boat. 
ready to go. Got my backpack all packed up. all packed, and yeah, I got everything I need. I was gonna wear the raspberry cream scuba, but like, I feel like everyone's expecting me to wear it, so that's why I'm not wearing it. Yeah, I'm weird like that. But I'm gonna head on out. Why do I make things complicated? Why do I lose? All right, you guys. So we just got to work. I was listening to Gals on the Go. Um, I like placed a Sephora order on my laptop. I don't know if I place the order on my mom's account or my account. So like I can't see when it's ready. So I'm texting my mom. First world problem, but basically it's a Charlotte Tilbury highlighter that I've wanted. And then when I got it, it was shattered. And every time I kept ordering it, it kept going out of stock. So I'm a little stressed right now, but it's okay. I don't need it, but I want it. So I'm going to head into work early because we got a lot of new product. And um, yeah. back home i'm literally so tired it's like not even funny but so i picked some stuff up at sephora so i got the paula's choice exfoliate skin perfecting 2 percent bha liquid exfoliant i've heard really good things about this i'm excited to use it here and then i finally got the charlotte tilbury pillow talk highlighter in the third edition so i'm very very excited and it's not shattered. It's just so pretty. And then this is what she looks like. I'm so excited for this. I've been waiting for it. <laughs> good morning now because i can literally visibly see constructions about to start outside my home this has been going on for like two weeks i don't understand what they're doing because i swear to god if they reopen what they just paved over like what was the point you know what i mean i don't really understand state or town construction honestly i just don't get it like when you open something and pave it back up and then reopen it you're literally making the roads so much worse than they already are and our road was actually really good before they touched it god it's just so annoying that's like the one thing that frustrates me because when you start paying taxes you realize like infrastructure and all the shit like you pay for so it's like oh it's so, annoying. so anyway good morning you guys i just get, like i already know how today's gonna go basically because i'm gonna try to vlog and then all you guys are gonna hear is construction so hopefully they're in and out i have just been like light editing this morning kind of like organizing need to get ready for orange theory i need to leave like very soon um yes i'm finally trying it i'm not pussying out this time um every single time i've tried to do it i've pussied out and i'm not doing it today i'm going to do it i've already made out the plan for today i was gonna do a morning routine but then it just wouldn't make sense because i want to tan after i go to orange theory to um because i basically just haven't tanned all week and i want to um so that's what i'm gonna 
orange theory that's why i recognize the number hi sam this is cam you just called me <laughs> good how are you um so this is my first orange theory class because i um pussied out of my first one Okay, perfect. Sure. Right. Sounds good to me. All right, awesome. Thank you. Okay, so basically I need to leave. Hold on, let me see how long it takes me to get there. Because I'm taking my damn time this morning, which is not cool. 16 minutes. Okay, I just need to leave at... 7.50, so I have 8 minutes to get ready. So, um, fuck, what do I wear? What do I wear? <laughs> okay, alright, I know I'm Alright, um, I'm gonna stop talking now, so, cause I can get ready, cause she told me I need to be there 30 minutes early, not 15. 30. Oh my god. Okay, so literally the construction people are right outside my window, and I can hear everything they're talking about. They're so funny. I like them. They're funny. I like them. They're just like about like the excavator or whatever the frig it's called um he was like what the fuck it was wicked funny oh fuck i need i need socks oh, oh. I need socks. I need socks. i need socks the shorts i want to wear are wet i'm like not as nervous as i thought i would be maybe it's because i've pussied out of so many orange theory classes that like i'm ready to go you know okay i decided i'm wearing the wet shorts and also i'm so sorry about the construction this is probably going to be an all-day thing so i'm gonna have to find somewhere else to film um, but I'm gonna go now, because I'm already wearing my Lululemon shoes, um, my track that shorts, and my long sleeve muscle in the same color as my shorts. <sighs> Wish me luck, and I'll tell y'all all about it when I get back home. I'm gonna vlog on my phone. Alright, you guys, so I just did Orange Theory, and oh my god, it was so fun. I really liked it. Um, it's expensive really really fun i really liked it i like the coach i like the aspect of it a lot um the only reason why i say it's expensive is because like you have to buy the hot well you don't have to you have to buy a heart monitor um well as i said whoa jesus as i said you don't really have to buy the heart monitor but like you waste you waste money not buying it if that makes any sense so you pretty much get charged ten dollars every single time you go and use a heart monitor so i was like what the fuck i didn't know that but i really really liked it um i think it's a really good thing for me to incorporate rather than just doing spin because like when i go to the gym like i want to coach you know what i mean so it's like the cheaper version of having a personal trainer pretty much but like in a class setting so i really liked it everyone was so fucking nice like so fucking nice like when i was on the treadmill um, for like the last part of class, everyone was so nice because I didn't know, like, this sounds stupid, but I didn't really understand how to work the treadmill. And they were all so freaking nice, like everybody there. So, yeah, now I'm going to go tan real quick because there's literally construction at my house. And then me and my sister are going to Watertown to do her hair. Alright, y'all, we're getting Starbucks right now. We both put on makeup and actually put effort into ourselves, except you usually always do. She's really excited. Yeah, look at this ratty ass ratty hair. Carol, my roots are bad too. Okay, but not really. Yeah, mine are blended really nice. I don't know what it just said. <laughs> it looks like I'm disgusted all the time, but that's just because this eyeliner is burning my eyes and I can't look at the sun. Just take it off. No! Drink some water. Drink some. Oh, I forgot to ask for a cup of ice. I don't know if you can hear the construction outside my window, but um, I never ended off the vlog, but Kira loved her hair. Katie did her hair um, at Behind the Hair. Um, she loved it, it came out so good, and she was super nice and made her first experience super nice. Sorry. <sighs> I'm super tired and I'm trying to edit so um yeah that's the end of this vlog I hope you guys enjoyed if you did give it a big thumbs up comment down below make sure you're subscribed and I love y'all so much and I'll see you in my next video